All right, this is Leroy with Sanders Auto. Our uh, phone number is 307-834-2450. And uh, we're going to go over some PDR work. Um, what it is is gluing tabs onto hail dent on your vehicle and pulling those little hail dents out. It's very easy. You don't need to go to a, a shop and and uh, spend a lot of money. You can do it yourself. We sell the tools to do it and we're going to show you how to use those tools. First of all, you want to clean it this spot real well. Denatured alcohol. We're going to work on this spot right here. A little bit of that down. Take you a soft cloth. Make sure you're getting all the wax and grease off road grime, whatever's on there. It's good and clean. Take your glue gun and with your glue fill that little hole up just a little bit. Put that tab right in the center and let it cool for about three to four minutes. And while we're doing that, I think we're just going to go ahead and work on another one here. There's a little one right there, you can see. And I don't know if you can see that in the camera or not. We can see this one right here, though. Well, all right. We're going to put a little bit glue on that one. And of course the bigger the the dent is, the more glue you want to put in it. Fill your tab. After you get done doing that, you get this little handy tool. It fastens right over the uh, pull tab. You may need to adjust it. Just a little bit, screw that down, slide that onto there. Snug it up, and then we'll just work that. Just and if it pulls it a little too far, we'll show you how to put, knock it back down. Just keep working that. Work it several times. Around. And here at Sanders Auto, we do this hail work, and it's very simple. You don't have to have a lot of training. Just kind of watch this video. You'll be able to do it yourself and save a lot of money there. And I'm going to give it a harder pull. Came right loose. Just take your denatured alcohol, put it on there, get a hold of that, a little more, there you go, there it is, pulls right off, get these little strings out of here, alright, I don't know if you can see that in the, pic in the camera now, but that is just a little high. What we're going to do, we're going to get a couple tools here. They're not called knockdown tools. There's this one here, it's rounded. There's that one, pointed. Um, we're going to use the rounded one this time. You don't want to tap hard. Just get you a little, uh, just a little one, uh, 16 ounce hammer. Just light. And hold pressure down on it just a little bit as you're doing this. Go around the edges of it. So going down.
go. Let's take and try to put it up on the other one. This back on here. And if you get a, a, a little heavier one, you may need to pull more than once. Uh, sometimes it takes three and four pulls. Once again, we'll just work that. Snap it loose. Now, if you have a large enough dent that you've got most of this here tab glued on, you're probably not going to be able to get that to snap like that. But what you need to do, take this here and just dump a little bit of, and work it around. You can take a, a little nylon tool, work up underneath there, and that will snap it loose. So, let's put a little more of this stuff. More alcohol on there, and that's denatured alcohol. Is what you put on there. It's got that. And there's that one there. It needs a little bit of knockdown, but very, very little. We got about the right good amount on that. There you go. That's how you take hail dents out of your uh, vehicle. Uh, somebody runs into the side of you, well, well runs into the side of you, not run in on the side of you. Open their door in the parking lot, go into the, uh, you go into Walmart and you come back out and you see a door ding on your vehicle. Um, just get you that little tab, put that onto that door ding and pull it, pull it out that way too. Now, you can uh, scar this up with this little tool, scratch things up. It don't look like we did it to this, but you you can. Uh, it's not not going to give you anything uh, major. Just get you some 1500 grit uh, wet and dry sandpaper. We do have that, and lightly sand it. Put a little water on there. Lightly sand it, then buff it back out, and you've got uh, a perfect job. Well, thanks for watching. This is Leroy with Sanders Auto. And we'll uh, do some more of these videos, instructional videos, so you check back soon.